As thousands of Arabs marched against the confiscation of their lands, the latest American mission to address that very question was wrapping up. U.S. envoy Dennis Ross has been trying to win support for an American proposal on the latest stage of an Israeli withdrawal from the West Bank, and he's hinting American patience is running out. We have said all along that it's very important to overcome the stalemate. We have also made it clear that at some point we have to bring this effort to a conclusion. But even before his final meeting with Ross, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu was predicting the envoy would be going home empty-handed. We are going to continue these discussions and probably get into questions of percentages before Mr. Ross leaves, though I doubt whether in such a short schedule we'll iron out all the issues. Even Russia is voicing its concerns. Israeli withdrawal from another occupied territory, southern Lebanon, was on the agenda of talks between UN Secretary General Kofi Annan and Russian Foreign Minister Yevgeny Primakov. Russia is calling on the Jewish state to leave the area. Frustration over America's inability to break the deadlock is growing in the occupied territories, with demonstrations yet again turning violent.